Hey YouTube fam, how you doing? Did you know there was a uh, receiver shortage? And I had no idea that there was a receiver shortage out there. Um, it's so funny because I made a mistake or I thought it was actually a good deal, but somebody offered to buy my receiver <clears throat> uh, after selling them something else out of uh, one of my uh, stereo listening rooms. And um, so I sold them, uh, it was the Panasonic uh, UB 820 uh, player and they were like well do you have a receiver around I'm like well the only receiver I have is the one I'm actually using um, you know I have some separate uh, amplification running through it as well it's in my main system my main room so they were like well I'll buy it from you um, I'm like well it's not really for sale but if the price is good enough you know I'll, you know I'll, I might entertain it not knowing that there is a receiver shortage out there I sold them the receiver Actually, I made profit off the receiver um, two years after I actually bought it, which is incredibly weird to me. So it dawned on me, you know what, I better go online here before I actually, you know, make the, the deal completely, you know, signed, sealed and delivered, so to speak, because he sent me the PayPal and everything. And it was in PayPal. So I'm looking around and I'm thinking, oh, this ought to be easy for me to upgrade. And uh, I think I'm going to go get the, with that new uh, Ankyo TXRZ50. So I'm looking around like, and Colin and Colin and Colin I had a good friend of mine in uh, Boston over there that helped me look. And uh, my, my other good friend over there in North Carolina, he was helping me look. We're looking for this doggone um, receiver and nobody could help, you know, nobody could find it. So I was thinking to myself, well, what's going on with this? So I started calling up and I started getting on the phone and people started laugh laughing at me like it was the... Uh, Christmas Turbo Doll, if you guys remember the movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Um, so I was looking around, and one guy even said he hasn't even seen the thing. He didn't know if he was, it was even real because they never had anything come in yet. And we're talking like this guy was saying, like, last April was the last time he'd seen any receivers come in. So it puzzled me, you know, you know, and then I remembered, oh, yeah, the chip shortage that's been going around with the, with the you know, different electronic components and stuff. So... Long story short, I went on Amazon and believe it or not, three of them popped up. And by the time I got my credit card out and started going in here and uh, trying to, you know, do the procedures, they were all three gone immediately. So I called the place that sold, sold these and the store is called One Call and very, very good company. But by the time I called, they were all three gone. And I said, what happened? And they said, well, it was so busy online that they took some of those down because they're going too fast and they were trying to keep from people from buying two and three and four or five at a time so they could try to double their money and all that kind of stuff like they do with the playstation 5 and the xbox uh, one a, uh, series x, uh, x so long story short i act, i got one they, they they sent me the link and i immediately checked through got it uh and got the uh, the, the fast shipping and everything I actually got this a few days ago and, was, and, and my, my, I was so unprepared that I don't even have my rack ready or anything like that uh, on the system. So I'm, I'm actually redoing the whole rack and the system and everything, cleaning up components, uh, cleaning up the cables and you know the whole nine yards and just kind of uh, and redoing the rack and everything. So it's gonna take me a day or two to even get this thing up. But I thought to myself, wow, I didn't know how uh, lucky I was till some of the people started saying, hey, man, I can't believe you got one. That's incredible. But I talked to the lady the next day, and she told me that they sold 50 of these within an hour. So I could not believe. Uh, incredible. 50 within an hour. And if you know this receiver, it's probably the best receiver out there for the money right now. Uh, 8K, 4K. You know the whole nine yards the uh, uh vrr um some, something about dynamic uh hdr the the allm qms uh, the whole nine art nine yards and it has the uh uh direct or direct or diarc d-i-a-r-c i believe it's called uh, it, it's basically their their system now from from that from odyssey to to that now they're so they're, you know, I guess they're only put these in the, in the higher end receivers and the high, the super high end stuff. Uh, a couple of years ago, I saw a video on it where somebody was actually kind of uh, 
complaining that they're putting them in the the uh, these components now that are around fifteen hundred two thousand um, dollars, and they I heard they only put them in like uh, you know like an eight thousand dollar preamp processor before. So um, all systems go. I'm not going to have a lame unboxing. I'm sure you guys seen a, a couple of these already, but uh, I, you know this thing does exist evidently, and here it is right in front of me. So I'm going to you know hook up the uh, PlayStation 5. I'm actually looking for an Xbox One X uh, without getting uh, completely raked over the coals from the people who sell reselling them for anywhere from I think I've seen 750 to a thousand, no 1100 for the Halo one. So, but I heard the sound quality on this is outstanding. This is not my first go around with the RZ series Onkyo. I had the last series as well. Um, like I said, I did have some separate amplification hooked up to my uh, gigantic speakers here. So, uh, but uh, last time I remember when I had it hooked up completely to the speakers to test it out, which I'm actually do this time around is hook it up directly to the speakers without the amps for, you know, to start off with. And then I'm gonna get some uh, Emotiva, Emotiva amps. Um, the X1, I believe it's called. Uh, I can't remember the, the name of it. It's the three channel monster. And then, um, you know, we'll go from there. But uh, just wanted to share that little story with you guys. And you guys have a Merry Christmas.